Hi, my name's Amira and welcome back to my channel. I ordered heaps off of Colourpop, heaps over Black Friday and everything. If you've been following me for a while, you'll know that I did like a Colourpop rant video. As I said, it was like kind of clickbaity. I don't hate Colourpop. I really like Colourpop. Um, I was just really upset because like all my eyeshadows dried out <laughs> in less than a year. I was really shattered and I kept them all tight. And yes, I could put like drop some stuff in them to make them liquidy or whatever but that would change the formula so i don't really want to do that so yeah and it's a shame because they're so beautiful the eyeshadows but yeah i just i don't know i don't want to have to replace them that much so yeah anyway love 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 the lip products i have so many lippy sticks i did a swatch video of the lippy sticks when i got them like a year ago and since they're doing free shipping now to Australia over a certain amount, I picked up quite a few things with the Black Friday sales and everything. So I thought I would show you the Hot to Trot. So this set has the five shades. You've got Cookie and Skimpy. So Cookie lipstick on one end, Skimpy on the other. You've got Cami and Bound, LBB with LBB. Trust Me with Bossy and Chateau with Dukes. So I thought I would swatch all of these on my lips so you can see the colors. I love the idea of this. It just makes it so easy to pop in your bag for touch-ups because you've got the lipstick on one end and the pencil on the other. I already know I love the formula, but I'm gonna start with Skimpy and Cookie because I already have these in like the full size regular. So I'll be able to see if the formula is any different in the minis versus the big ones. And this is ColourPop Ultra Matte in Trap. And I like the color. It's a little drying, the formula for Ultra Matte. I have a few Ultra Mattes. I haven't tried them too much yet because as I said, it kind of all came just in like the last few weeks or last few, as in like last week or two, and I've been working heaps, so I haven't got a chance to try them out. I tried the Ultra Satin Lips out, and I thought I picked really nude shades, but they're all kind of not so nude. They're all like pretty bold. They're like bold nudes. <laughs> so Skimpy is actually one of my favorite pencils. I love it. It's like one of my favorite nude pencils ever. It's just the perfect combination of everything. I like that it winds up as well, because the annoying thing with the other ones is that you have to sharpen them, and um, I uh, never have a sharpener around, so, no. Ugh, same amazing formula. Oh, yes. This lip pencil is just my perfect nude lip pencil. I love it. Love it. And then this is Cookie. These are smaller, like as in the lipstick is skinnier, but I don't think that matters too much. Check that. That's your perfect nude. Perfect nude lipstick. I think the Colourpop should do these anyway. Um, maybe not even in the minis. Like, this would be perfect. Say, so if you're going clubbing, because you've got your lip pencil and your lipstick in the one, it's just, it's really good. I, I really like that. Although the lid isn't going back on. Do I have to uh, push it extra hard? Okay, I've got the lid back on. This is just, oh, I feel like though, because I've worn Cookie before, I feel like this formula was a bit drier going on, but I do like how it looks still. Um, because like the mattes that I have in the lippy sticks, they're more of like a creamy matte, not a super matte matte. So this is definitely more of like a matte, not like a transfer proof matte or anything. Um, beautiful Ooh, i want to put this i think i'm going to put this back on when i finish doing these lip swatches this is a gorgeous color gorgeous this is bound and cami i actually have bound already bound is the lip pencil in this one i'm pretty sure i've got bound in a pencil and a lipstick and then cami oh yes that's nice it's so smooth going on i like this this is like a slightly more wearable version of Lumiere, um, the Kathleen Lights Colourpop lipstick. I really liked Lumiere in the photos and when I put it on it's just so much darker. Whereas this is kind of like the exact same but slightly toned down. Beautiful shade, matches my eyeshadow perfectly. This is Bossy and Trust Me. So Bossy is the pencil. I always say I'm not the biggest red person but I've been wearing red a lot more often lately. I don't know why. Why the change of heart? I feel like it kind of maybe suits like my more pink hair. Um, I quite I quite like it. And then we've got Trust Me, the other red. Oh. This red is beautiful. 
Wow, this is like your perfect, like classy red. Like going out to a super fancy premiere for something, like this is that red. It's just gorgeous. This is stunning. I really like this. Something I will say is that like Colourpop, they've got their lipsticks and the matching lip pencils, but I find it weird that this set, only one of the shades has the same for the lip pencil and the lipstick. Like, cause Cookie has a, comes in a lipstick and a lip pencil. Skimpy comes in a lipstick and a lip pencil. And um, Bound comes in a lipstick and a lip pencil. Cause I know, cause I have all of those ones. The other ones I'm not sure of cause I don't have them. Yeah. Um, so I do find that a bit strange. But having said that, the ones that I have, the colors don't match perfect. Whereas these ones that I've tried on so far, the matches are perfect, like just perfect. And I think that these are all matte formulas. I'm guessing that's how they feel going on, all matte. Whereas a lot of the ones I have are like more glossy or whatever, but the lipsticks and the lip liners match perfectly, perfectly. That was something I was disappointed with when I did buy, you know, so many lipsticks and lip pencils. I really kind of wanted them to match. <sighs> this lipstick, I like that so far all the shades have been quite varied. You've got your light nude, deep mauve nude, and then a red. Then we've got two left, and from the outside they look the same. One is though more wine and one is more brown. So let's see how they go. Let's pop on LBB and LBB. LBB, LBB, yes. Can I say beautiful any more times? So this is LBB, LBB. LBB, both ends, this one matches. This is your perfect purple wine shade. I think it's coming up a bit darker on camera than in real life. Real life, it's a little bit brighter. Um, it's really nice though. It kind of reminds me of, if we grab out Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette, it reminds me of the Love Letter shade. Um, yeah, they're like almost the exact same. That's beautiful. This is really nice. I really like how every color that I put on has matched my makeup as well. And my makeup is quite bold, very wine and bronze. Um, yeah, I'm really impressed. Like pretty much every shade I put on has looked beautiful with it. Kind of like, you know, I almost planned it out that way. So this is like a really good universal set. All right, so this is Dukes and Chateau. This looks really dark. Let's see if I've got a steady hand. The answer to steady hand is no, but when in doubt, just draw your lips bigger to fill in the mistakes. Normally when I put on bold lip pencils, I kind of just color them over most of my lip, but because I want to see, you know, compared the lipsticks and the lip pencils together, um, this kind of just helps me. Yeah, these are like the exact same shade as well. This feels the smoothest though, going on. Again, this matches my makeup perfectly. I mean, it's very, very bold, but I love this shade. This is stunning. It's all really nice. These make me want to wear nude lipstick less. Um, I really like them. I like them. I, I love ColourPop pencils and lipsticks. I couldn't recommend them more highly, especially for the price. This set the minis were kind of smaller than I was expecting when they came. I was like, oh, that's a minis. Like I thought they would be, I don't know why, just in my head, I didn't read it properly. I just assumed they would be full size as in like, this is a normal lip pencil. Um, oh, I guess it's only a little bit shorter, um, but they are a lot skinnier as well. But I was kind of yeah, expecting it to be like the same size pencil, one side lipstick on the other. So like I knew you get less, but I don't know why. Anyway, these are little, uh, that's fine. I can deal with that. They're beautiful. I love that they're all paired perfectly. Great if you're in a hurry because you can just pick up one and you know that you're going to have a matching pencil there. So yeah, I like that. I'm happy with these. I think that these are a beautiful assortment of shades. I think if you only kind of wear the same lipstick every day, but you want to start trying more, this is going to be a perfect kind of set if you can get your hands on it. And as I said, I love the formula of the ColourPop lipsticks. So yeah, two thumbs up from me. Yeah. <laughs> if there's any shades you think I should check out, comment below and let me know because I will definitely check it out. I'm hoping that ColourPop are gonna keep doing free international shipping to Australia next year. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. 
Fingers crossed they were trialing it and it went well and now they're gonna continue on with that because yeah. Anyway, <laughs> thank you so so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.